must in your way to express probability. Hello learners! Today, we have an interesting topic to explore. The modal verb, must. It is a versatile word and one of its primary uses is to express probability. Today, we will focus on exactly that. By the end of this video, you'll be able to confidently use must to indicate what is likely or probable. Before diving into how must expresses probability, let's understand what must is. Must is a modal verb used in English. Like other modal verbs, it helps to modify the verb that follows it, changing the meaning of the sentence. Most often, must is used to express necessity or obligation. But did you know it can also indicate probability? Yes, it can, and that's what we're going to learn about now. When used to express probability, must indicates that the speaker believes something is very likely based on the information they have. For instance, if you see someone carrying an umbrella that is dripping water, you might say, it must be raining outside. Here, must indicates your belief that it is raining, based on the evidence you can see. Building a sentence with must to express probability is simple. The structure generally follows this format. Subject plus must plus verb, base form, plus object, complement. Let's see some examples. John's not answering his phone. He must be busy. She's wearing a heavy coat. It must be cold outside. Remember, must is used when the speaker is quite certain, based on the available evidence. Just as must can be used to express high probability, must not can be used to indicate a high level of improbability or impossibility. The structure for these sentences is subject plus must not plus verb, base form, plus object, complement. Here are some examples. He must not be at home. His car is not in the driveway. You must not be tired if you're still up studying at 2 a.m. In these examples, must not is used to convey the speaker's belief that something is highly unlikely or impossible. So, that's all about using must to express probability. Remember, must is a very strong word, and it is used when the speaker is quite certain about something. On the contrary, must not is used to show that something is highly unlikely or impossible. Keep practicing and soon, using must to indicate probability will come naturally to you. Keep learning and stay tuned for our next lesson. Happy learning!